On the third day of Kitsuke, my musubi will be Kainokuchi. Hello everyone, welcome back to the 12 days of Kitsuke. Today we'll be looking at the Kainokuchi musubi. Kainokuchi means clam's mouth musubi, but you might have to use your imagination a bit to visualize a clam's mouth. It's the most popular musubi for men's kitsuke, but women can wear it as well. Let's take a look. For this musubi, you will need a hanhaba obi. Start with the obi in your right hand. Bring it around your back to your right hip. To measure the short end of the obi, the tesaki end, always measure from your right hip. If you measure from the middle, your tesaki will be too short. So measure from the right hip. This musubi requires mm, about 30 centimeters or so. That's good. Fold the tesaki in half, flip it up, and wrap. If you have a very long obi, you may need to wrap twice, but this one's okay. Bring the short end, the desaki, to the middle. This is your reference length. The long end has to be about three centimeters longer. So I'm going to match them up, approximately three centimeters more. That's my fold point. I fold it back in on itself. And I tuck it in. Most other musubi, when you tie the knot, it is short end over long end. In this one, it's the reverse. It's the long end, the wide end, over the short end. Go ahead and tie your knot. Now we're going to form a V and we're going to aim our V towards the tail end. So bring it up like that. And bring the short end in and pull it through. And to turn it around, your right hand goes on the musubi, your left hand goes on the obiita, and you spin. See my book? <laughs> 